Hello guys, uh, this is Nilima Godavalli, the director of Shades of Baby Pink speaking. Thank you for providing such a great platform to showcase a good content and I also wanted to thank all the filmmakers around the world um, who got an opportunity to showcase their good content here. Shades of uh, Baby Pink, the initial idea came up in um, 2020s uh, when I was in flight and traveling from Seattle to Dubai. Um, it's very common to see grandparents bringing children back um, home, India, uh, especially when both parents are working in Seattle. And because the childcare in Seattle is very expensive and um, the time is a luxury, especially both parents are working. Often at times, um, you see the child fall asleep as soon as uh, they are on board and um, they wake up um, in, during the middle of the journey, a uh, stopover in Dubai and search for parents and when you kind of try to die with them, they kind of play or they tend to forget it. So, but this particular instant um, is different. Uh, so, a kid is really inconsolable. Uh, as soon as he woke up and he did not find a parents and he was just crying, 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 neither the toys nor the grandmother kind words helped him. Um, he was just crying until um, he fall asleep. Um, this incident um, really um, moved everybody witnessing that incident. They were, everybody felt bad and I almost moved into tears. Even after coming back, uh, I started thinking about it and um, I realized that this is the, this particular emotional stress the child is going through. Um, this needs to be told. So I started penning a fictional story, um, taking the theme uh, of reflecting the emotional stress of the child, uh, how child uh, uh, can go through this kind of an emotional stress in spite of giving him all comforts um, if he's missing the parents and in the parents absence obviously child will go through so much emotional stress with that theme i started penning the story so that's the origin for uh, shades of uh, baby pink film so we kind of um, uh, filmed this uh, entire story um, in six to i think six days uh, there's a lot of time we spent on pre-production, about six months and uh, the biggest challenge that I faced as soon as I finished the script is finding the uh, lead actor, the child, um, because I was thinking of casting a four to five years old child uh, to reflect uh, that kind of an emotional stress and all that. So it took some time for me to find the right child actor for this film and I almost auditioned 60 to 62, 65 kids and uh, finally found Ishu who's the lead actor in this movie. We trained him for about three three months, three close to I think four months and uh, starting from the basic expressions to till uh, the time he delivers the dialogue and un understand the scene and all that. We did almost all the importance to scenes the demo shoot so that um, uh, the child actor understand how he should emote um, uh, with the and 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 also it's very important for him to understand the rest of the actors and um, the chemistry has to work. So even the um, lead actors, uh, the other actors cooperated very well and they supported us um, uh, and participating in demo shoots and they supported really well in during the actual shoot as well. The story has two threads. One is uh, um, emotional stress the child go through and the other one is his ability to question back. Um, often at times you undermine the child intelligence but they connect dots very well and they figure out a solution by themselves by connecting the dots and question back. Um, most often I have uh, noticed that we undermine their intelligence but at times when they question back we are really struck and we don't know how to respond to them. So this is well reflected in this movie and um, this particular movie, um, everyone, every household could relate to it and because uh, every household must have experienced this kind of situation uh, with the kid when they question back and when they try to connect the dots and all of that. Um, I wanted to thank uh, every cast and every member of cast and crew who supported me 
uh, through this journey and without their help uh, this film wouldn't have uh, reached to the stage uh, where it is at right now i also wanted to thank every one of you um, uh, for watching the film and supporting the film and uh, I, I i i guess we made a very good uh, effort or attempt um, and um, and thank you so much and um, that's all and signing off thank you